In this video, I will show you how to tie a jig spinner. Not sure if there's a similar jig out there, but let's just call this the raw jig spinner. I would say that this lure is very similar to a inline spinner with all the flash, but still, it's still different in many different ways. So for all you trout fishermen, especially the ones who like to chase those brown trout, this is an awesome lure. The reason why I like this jig more than inline spinner is that one, it does not have any treble hook. It makes catch and release very easy, especially if you don't plan on keeping any trout. And in, in addition, unhooking fish is so much easier, especially when you net the trout and they death roll all over your net. This jig has only one single hook, and if you guys are into debarbing, heck, one debarb hook. Let's go. So let's go over the materials that you will need. First, you need a small willow blade, size one. Got this from Cabela's, 15 in a pack. As you can see, it's a little bigger than a dime. You can choose whatever shape and colors you want for spinners. I chose silver, but I also use gold for stain water conditions. And I so happen to use the hammer once as it has more light reflection in many different angles. Chenille, pick your favorite color. I like greens with some flash. Split ring, size zero. Swivel, size 12. I usually use 1 16th ounce jig head, but you guys can fiddle depending on what depth and how, how fast you want to retrieve it. I use 140 thread, brand doesn't matter, but UTC is very popular out there. And then you need some braid line. First, you want to assemble your swivel, split ring, and your willow blade. Take your braid line about a few inches, double up, loop it through your swivel, and bring the tag end back into the loop as shown as here. Secure the hook on the vise and start building the thread from the head down to the bend and then back up just a little bit. Place your little swivel contraption at the end right here and then you want to secure the back of the swivel onto the hook. Careful and make sure that the bottom part of the swivel will still continue to spin. Then secure the braid onto the shank. Take the braid and wrap a few times around the shank, then re-secure the braid with the thread. Trim the extra braid. Bring the thread to the head of the jig and secure the chenille all the way down the shank, but do not get too close to the swivel as it may impede the spinning action. Bring the thread back to the head, wrap the chenille to the head, and then tie off the excess chenille. Put finish and add your favorite glue. Now you're done. Very simple to tie, isn't it, eh? This jig is a trout killer, especially for brown trout, but it's also very good in catching crappies, bass pickles, heck, any other species you guys can think of. Thank you for watching. Hope this lures catches you a ton of fish. Don't forget to subscribe to see more hand tie lures as well as some fish slaying videos. Tight lines.